Hello everyone, I welcome you all for this wiki tutorials. In this video, I am going to discuss about uh, how to pass the examination the fourth semester subject title called uh, Discrete Mathematical Structures with the uh, subject uh, code BCS405A for 2022 scheme. So, mainly my intuition of uh, doing this video is for how to pass this examination those who are feeling difficulty so they can uh, go through this video they will come to know how to pass this examination easily and uh, my intention is not uh, concentrating on only 35 marks so you can score more than 35 marks uh, those who like this video kindly do subscribe to my youtube channel and also do share this video with your friends coming to module one so in module one you know that uh, it is of uh, fundamentals of logic if you know how to construct the truth table they will be providing a compound proposition you need to construct the truth table and they have been asked uh, logically equivalence so you need to prove that uh, both uh, left hand side and right hand side are one and the same so which is nothing but you need to prove that it is a tautology or contradiction that's all so if you go through this you can also have the choice here here also they have been given the same thing you need to define tautology and you need to prove that the given truth table is tautology so for that you can have maximum of six marks so next if you have have the awareness of loss of logic or uh, loss of uh, rules of inference if you know loss of logic uh, definitely you can solve the problems of rules of inference also it is a, a bit of uh, same content you're going to have so you can also study that problem or else you can leave it i insist you to study uh, proofs of theorems called uh, direct proof indirect proof proof by contradiction definitely one problem will be given so therefore i can prefer that uh, six plus seven so you can score maximum or minimum of 30 marks in this module one so coming to module two uh, there will be a, a problems on mathematical induction so definitely one problem will be there compulsory problem so you uh, for uh, if for your reference if you want more problems on uh, uh, important problems on mathematical induction or uh, dms uh, content you can refer uh, the previous year question paper or uh, with the subject uh, code 18 cs 36 18 cs 36 you can refer this uh, uh, subject title you are going to have plenty of questions over there so apart from this uh, mathematical induction this is one compulsory six marks then uh, go with uh, binomial theorem uh, with uh, repetition that will be another uh, compulsory question so carries uh, seven marks so totally you can also have here maximum or minimum 13 marks minimum 13 marks you can uh, have here so apart from that if you go with uh, module 3 in module 3 you can score out of out in this module that is uh, 20 marks so i prefer you to not to um, leave any content of this module so first one is uh, you are going to study pigeonhole principle uh, state pigeonhole principle and uh, problems on pigeonhole principle then go with the uh, zero matrix and directed graph compulsory one problem will be there then after that you can go with the uh, functions in functions you can study composition functions inverse functions uh, so if you study bo these two things that is enough so you can score 20 out of 20 marks see in choice question also you are going to have composition function so and uh, problems on uh, uh, like uh, show that uh, if uh, n plus 1 numbers are chosen from 1 to 2n 2n then at least one pair one pair will add to 2n plus 1 this kind of problem will be there apart from that as a diagram and also uh, partial order set you are going to have uh, posit problems so definitely you can score 20 out of 20 marks in this module so coming to module 4 you can have uh, compulsory one question on principles of inclusion that is uh, the problem like uh, none of the patterns of the form car dog pun or bite so like this uh, uh, different uh, words will be given one problem will be compulsory will be given like that you in the choice also they have been given the problems on principles of inclusion like exactly two pairs or none of the pairs or at least three pairs like this the problem will be given so you can go through this uh, kind of problem compulsory you will get six marks here and apart from this uh, principles of inclusion i prefer you to go through derangement problems 
since it is very easy to solve uh, knowing the definition and uh, solving the problem is very simple within uh, five minutes you can solve the problem so i prefer uh, seven marks here if you are not comfortable with uh, derangements go with the rook polynomials go with rook polynomials and also if you are aware of uh, solving a differential equation problem you can study recurrence relations there also you can score seven marks in this module also i feel that you can score 20 out of 20 marks but if you are not comfortable you can score minimum of 13 marks coming to last module that is module 5 in module 5 i prefer you to first go through lagrange's theorem it is a compulsory question so you can score 17 marks over there and uh, claim four group uh, problems definitely one problem will be there on claim four group uh, problems apart from these two you can study uh, the problems on uh, cyclic group coset uh, here this is what left coset right coset permutation problems permutation problems here subgroup problems so here also minimum you can score if you study all these questions you can score minimum 13 marks so this is the way of uh, studying uh, the dms paper so now if you count the uh, uh, weightage of uh, whatever i gave now in from uh, first module you can score minimum 13 in second module also you can score minimum 13 in third module you can score maximum 20 marks out of out you can score in fourth module i will also prefer uh, 13 in uh, uh, fifth module i will go with 13 itself so totally here 6 plus 6 uh, 12 so carry 1 so 5 plus 2 72 marks you can score so here out of 100 marks whatever the way i told you you can score 72 marks but you needed 35 to pass the examination but i am giving uh, first class marks here so if you go through this video you can definitely score first class marks so this is what the promise i can give so if you like this video kindly do subscribe to my youtube channel and also do share this video with your friends and for more video you can refer my previous videos Thank you all for watching this video.